Hello, my name is Lou Pine for these robots. I am a humanoid service robot. Hey guys, my name is Sid and welcome to another vlog. So today is Jitex 2017. If you haven't seen my previous vlog from last year, it's a huge, huge technology conference that happens here in Dubai. And I'm super excited to go this year because they're gonna be having a couple of cool things going on over there. So one cool thing is that the Dubai government is gonna introduce the new flying taxis that are gonna be introduced very soon in Dubai. So I'm looking forward to see what that's like. And then they have this whole area where they have a bunch of startups exhibiting. So I'm very curious to see what the other startups in Dubai are up to. But it should be fun. Lots of cool, new, interesting technology to check out at Jitex. I'll see you guys on the way. Yeah, so this Jitex is a bit different from the Jitex shopper that happens, um, you know, which I showed you the last time. There it's more like a consumer experience. And here it's more about showing the latest and greatest in tech. So, um, you know, it's quite different. They don't sell anything over here. They just show, companies come here to show their latest equipment, the latest software, consumer technology and other stuff. So, this is like a facial recognition technology. So, when you're just walking by, you see it. It's recognizing my face there. That age is not accurate. Yeah, so, here what they're doing is they're showing all kinds of augmented reality applications for shopping. So I just want to show you some of the cool things that they've come up with over here. So check this out. I've been your virtual personal assistant. So it kind of works like this. They have like a screen over here where you can choose the product. And then the virtual assistant will like give you more uh, information about the product. You just choose one of these? Yeah, we just chose the lemon. I guess. And then, and then she'll talk about she's the lemon? Talk. Do you want me? No. You're cooking as a piece of the example. Okay. Try a lemon tart. <laughs> so this is what palm recognition for payment. I just wave it. Oh. So now what that's done is it's recognized the scan your palm. Now no need for anything other than just zero okay. to scan your palm for me, please. That work? Yeah, and cool. So Everything, nice. it's normal, it's also balance statement. So I spoke to them a little bit more about what exactly they're doing and it's quite interesting. Basically they have this new technology that scans up to four of your fingers at the same time as you wave it over the sensor. So it's pretty accurate and, um, and they're showing different applications over here like you could use it at an ATM machine or for payment over the counter. Alright guys, these are, this is Insta360. They're basically like the GoPros of 360 degree cameras. And um, it's something that you can buy off the shelf and attach it to your phone, like what this guy is doing over here. Oh, you can instantly take, and you can instantly take 360 degree photographs. It's been out for a while. I was thinking of getting one, but I'm not sure about the 360 thing. How do I? Okay. Yeah, you can turn around. So so. <laughs> And you can take a picture like this, right? Yeah, yeah. You can do both pictures. Video or picture? This is picture. And you can do... Uh... And the picture comes out circular? Oh. So that's like an underwater drone and apparently the first one is a 4K camera. can do so you can see the screen curves around this thing it looks pretty damn cool this thing over here is called Dell Precision something like um, the Microsoft Surface Studio I don't know if you guys have seen that but it's like a touch enabled drawing board if you are still curious you can ask my human colleagues from Gas Digital Media <laughs> They are not as cute as I am, but they try their best. 
So guys, this behind me is the, the drone that uh, the Dubai government is planning to launch as a taxi service. So you'll actually be able to sit in that and like call it like an Uber and then take you places. It's insane. Let me have a closer look. So it looks like it's got seating for two and uh, definitely not as intimidating as a helicopter but pretty close like it's like a tiny helicopter and very strange propeller structure if you see on the top there's like on the outer ring and on the inner ring as well they have a set of propellers I don't know if you can see it but yeah it looks it looks very interesting I definitely want to try it when it starts Check this out. This is like a drone motorcycle. Wow. Look at the way you control that. So they literally have a Dubai police autonomous robot over here. The first of its kind. Like, I'd say we're like. 15-20 years out from having a real Robocop. Like, this is pretty much, I think, the closest we've got so far. What can you do? If fine. <laughs> you have good hair, eh? <laughs> I wish I had hair. <laughs> Hello, my name is Dubai Police Robot. I am a humanoid service robot created in Barcelona by Pum Robotics. I am the latest incorporation to Dubai's police department. Goodbyes are not forever. Goodbyes are not the end. They simply mean I'll miss you until we meet again. Thank you, the Dubai police. That's like the best stuff over here. Look at this bike, man. It's really insane. And it has like uh, it has like an iPad over here. I guess they can use the service on the. I think there's like a special camera in front as well. Just look at this bike. It's, it's beautiful. Excited to see what Etisala has going on this year because this year the food was mind blowing. So let's see what it's like. So, yeah, we're now at the Etisala stall and they always have the coolest stuff over here. So. Check out the recessed steering wheel. And you see the passenger has a separate. This steering wheel is hidden and yes. it is on autonomous drive right now. But when you press the button to the manual driving, the steering wheel comes up and makes a full circle. Really. They have the Mercedes autonomous car over here. This is the Mercedes autonomous vehicle and uh, it's what Mercedes thinks is going to be the future of cars. So there's actually no driver's seat in there. So I'm going to show you guys the interior right now. Yeah, there's like infotainment displays on the screen. So you can see the screen over there. That's what it looks like when it's closed. They do have a driver's dashboard. I think this chair swirls around and you can take manual control. So here's a good look at the Tesla Model X. Here's the four-wheel drive one. Teslas don't have an uh, engine in the front, so they actually have a, what is called a trunk or a front trunk. I think my next car might actually be a Tesla. Um, you know, the Model 3 is pretty reasonably priced. Comes out at about $35,000. I think with options, it's about forty-five. dollars Not too bad considering what you get for it. But let's see, they haven't really started delivering to customers yet. Once they do, the reviews are good. Very, very tempting for Mumta's next car. We 
heading to GTEx Future Stars and this is one of my favorite parts of this place because that's where all the startups are and uh, I'm, I'm always curious to see what people are coming up with and uh, where the future is headed so let's go check that out so this is where all the apps and, and the new startups in Dubai are going to be so there's like a startup pitch competition going on right now show you a bit of it so you are from TFC and you got 30 seconds starting now. Hi, one quick question. How many of you want to build your home? You oh. purchase a plot and you, you what next? What's the, what, 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 where do you go? Any clues? No, we are the solution for it. We are concentrating on two major industries, construction and logistics sector, where we are giving a platform, iOS and Android to the users from individual to the companies to mingle with all engineering consultants, main contractors, subcontractors, suppliers, and as well as logistics uh, providers, where they can throw their project requirement, get quotations, not only get quotations, award them, not only awarding them, till handing over of the keys. We will guide them with all the authority norms, whatever is happening from A to Z. Sorry. 30 seconds starts now. Uh, finding an expert in uh, any industry or field, such as legal expert or how to develop a business plan expert, uh, could be a logistical nightmare. So we'd like to introduce you to a digital solution which will make your life easier. Time Viewer is a digital platform enabling bringing together experts with those seeking their expertise, enabling users to connect with uh, uh, connect in a real time to experts in white in, in a wide spectrum of industries and all right guys, so that's it for GTEx 2017. Unfortunately, most of the startups were already closed by the time I got there. So I wasn't really able to shoot too much, but uh, I might go back for one of the other days. It's still on for another three days. So if you guys want to visit GTEx, it's still on. So if you guys like this video, hit that like button, leave a comment and subscribe to watch more videos like this. I'll see you guys in the next one.